hi guys welcome back to my channel so for today i'm in a very fall mood so i just wanted to do my makeup do like a super fall smoky eye and i just thought i would do a little get ready with me so yeah if you're new to my channel please hit the subscribe button down below and give this video a thumbs up and if you want to get ready with me and watch me do my makeup, then just keep watching. Okay, so I am so ready for fall. I know everyone says that, but I'm like really, really ready. So that's just what I want to do today. I have my mirror right here. I don't want to blind you, but I have my mirror. And I just wanted to do my makeup. So... First step is foundation. I've already moisturized my face. I use the Cetaphil, is that how you pronounce it? Body and face moisturizer, I think. And now I'm gonna use my Tarte Rainforest of the Sea water foundation in the shade Fair Neutral. I'm also still kind of sick. I told you guys in my last video, my pamper routine, that I was not feeling the best, so. If you haven't seen that video, check it out. I want to try different foundations because I've been using this Tarte one literally forever. And I love it, don't get me wrong, but I want to try different ones. But I just have such a hard time finding my shade. Like, I have more pink undertones than like yellow, so... It's just hard to find one that matches me. You know, I go to Ulta and they help me, which is good, but it's just frustrating. Like I really wanted the, what is it? The Too Faced Born This Way foundation, but they don't really have a shade for me because they only really have like yellow undertones, which I do not have. I'm going to use my Tarte Shape Tape in the shade Fair because I am pale. Or Mercier translucent powder. I really like this one. I tried the Maybelline Fit Me powder in the shade 10. And I don't know if it was the foundation I was using it with or what, but it made me so dry. It was awful. I really did not like it. So the Laura Mercier one is the one that I always go back to. And it comes in such like a big component. I feel like I don't run out a lot. And I mean, I set my entire face with this, like under eyes, cheeks, chin, like everywhere. And I don't feel like I run out quickly, so what it is i just haven't been like feeling the greatest you know like just uninspired not just like not i don't want to say not happy with myself because that sounds dramatic but just like you know i'm in a funk we'll go with that okay the mark jacobs omega bronzer coconut perfect tan and this thing is huge. Like I've had this for at least like well over a year. And you like never hit pan. And I like, I use quite a bit. And I have not hit pan yet. I really like this because it just like brings life back into your face after you've just made yourself look so like flat and one dimensional i really like this to just bring life back so in my you really gotta get down here because like what is this double chin situation? Like, go away. So in my 
Spirit Halloween haul, I had said that, I think I said that I had ordered Morticia Adams in the Funko Pops. And I had said that she was coming the next day. I filmed that on a Thursday and I said that she was coming that Friday. Long story short, she never showed up and I had paid for two day shipping. So I was a little bit upset because I had ordered it on that Tuesday and it said she was gonna be here Friday and she never showed up. So I was like, okay, whatever, I'll wait till Saturday. Saturday rolls around, still not here. So I was like, okay. So, sorry. <laughs> I waited until the first of the week. I was like, I'll give them till the end of the weekend, first of the week, and then if I haven't gotten her, then I'll email them. Monday rolls around, still haven't gotten her. So I was like, well, you know, like this is ridiculous now. I paid for two day shipping or like speedy day shipping and she said she'd be here Friday and she's not here. Where is she? So I emailed Spirit Customer Service and I was like, you know, this is my order number. I had placed this order on Tuesday and it said it was gonna be here Friday. It's not here. Can anyone help me? And they were very nice, very quick, very efficient. They were like, oh, we're so sorry. There's been a delay at the warehouse and it still hasn't shipped yet. And I was like, okay, that's kind of frustrating, but okay, whatever. And then they were like, check back to see the status of your order. And I was like, okay. So I'm gonna put on blush now with the uh, Tarte um, Whitney Simmons collab. This little, it's got eyeshadow, blush, and a highlighter. I mean, I, as you can tell, I love this. So it was like two or three days, still nothing. I emailed them again and said, you know, has my order shipped? And they were like, no, we've reached out to the warehouse. We don't really know what's going on. Like blush makes such a difference. And I was like, okay, like this is getting frustrating, but okay. And they were like, you know, we were very sorry. We'll do whatever. And I was like, well, I, I feel like it's too harsh, so I'm just gonna go over this with a damp, dry beauty blender just to blend it together. This is just my cheek being red. This cheek is always red. I'm so, I'm getting so off topic. So emailed them that day and they were like, you know, we will refund your shipping fee because it hasn't shipped by the time that it said, it, or it hasn't been delivered by the time it said it was going to. <clears throat> Sorry. So I was like, great, thank you so much. That was like two weeks ago. Fast forward to, what was it, Sunday. Still hadn't shipped, still hadn't heard anything from them. No refund. This is the NYX three-in-one brow pencil in the shade black. Long story short, she finally shipped. She'll be here, I think, Saturday. It's currently Thursday. So, and they said I'll get my refund sometime. I just put on the lipstick that came with the Whitney and Tarte collab, and it's in the shade Bare Bud. It's just like a nude lipstick. I really like it. So now on to the eyes, the part that I am most excited for. I have this fan here when I spray my face. I look crazy with just these eyebrows on. <sighs> Jaclyn Hill X Morphe, the original palette. I, this is kind of gross, but this palette is loved by me. Like look at the top, like, I love this palette. So I think I'm just gonna go in with the shade, I don't know the name. I have the card, but it's disappeared. I'm gonna go in with this shade right here and put this in my crease. 
This palette blends so well and so easily. Like, I'm not the best at, like, eyeshadow. And it just blends so easily. And it's not patchy. It's not streaky. I can honestly say I've used every single color in this palette. And it is amazing. I forgot highlighter. But, okay, so Morticia is coming Saturday. And then I was going to cancel the order and order her on Amazon because I found her there. And I was just going to cancel it and order her there. And then I went to Hot Topic, like, Saturday, I think. Because I was looking for Nightmare for Christmas. And I found Gomez... Pugsley and Uncle Fester. So I was like, oh, okay. And Hot Topic was having a sale on their Funko Pops. They were three for 27. So, I mean, of course I had to get all three. And they didn't have Wednesday and they did not even have Morticia there. So I was just gonna cancel the entire order and get them all there. But they didn't have Wednesday or Morticia. Now I'm going to use the highlighter in the shade Flex. Just put that on my face. Now I'm going to put some on my nose. I love nose highlight. I think it's my favorite place to highlight. I like my lip. I just bring it everywhere. Okay, so that is done. Next, I'm going to curl my eyelashes. I think I got this at maybe Ulta or something. And then I'm going to use the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. This is the Coco by Kylie Cosmetics Matte Liquid Lipstick in the shade Clow Money. And there you have it, guys. Guys? There you have it, guys. That is the final look. I know this video was super boring and I was like all over the place and a hot mess. You know, that's just what happens sometimes. You have good days, bad days, you're all over the place, you know. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.